What's up guys, it's your boy Kiamis Rockoff Johnson here with another video and honestly this video isn't something I necessarily want to make oh, stick that back in there. This video isn't something I necessarily want to make um, You guys love this car, right? Heck, I'm sure you guys that watch my videos not even just for this car or for the racing and the car meets and everything I'm sure you guys um, own modified cars yourselves, right? Uh, so I'm not going to go in detail in this video because truth be told, uh, there are two YouTube channels that I watch that give a great explanation, way far better than what I could ever do, of what's going on. Um, and they are linked down below. Uh, all the links in the description today has nothing to do with my merch. Forget all that right now. Um, we'll get on all that, all our regular stuff later. Uh, but all the links down below. The first one is to, um, well, actually, I believe I believe I'll make the first ones, uh, the the act, the videos of explaining what the RPM Act is and everything that I'm about to talk about. Um, and then the link after that will be uh, to actually uh, vote for the RPM Act uh, presented by SEMA, basically. But yeah all right so bottom line is i'm pretty sure you guys have been seeing you know save motorsports everywhere all over the internet and all that kind of stuff and i'm sure that especially by the time this is uploaded a lot of you guys would have heard something about it well it's not a joke um the epa is really trying to take uh motorsports from us you know regular people you know i do understand that in some other countries uh, they do have very strict laws and they're not able like regular people aren't able to really modify their cars or do anything like that and you know okay all right i get it but here me being a car enthusiast with a modified car of course i'm gonna sound biased but just hear me out okay because motorsports is not only a over two billion dollar um industry here in america uh, with modifying cars and everything but motorsports in general is a huge part of american car culture um and that's why people actually love american you know laws when it comes to cars because they can't modify cars where they are and i understand that the epa wants to make the environment better i am big on nature everything i do um is for the most part natural I only use natural products um yeah ev everything i try to do uh for the most part that's within my budget uh i really try to do for the earth i don't litter i don't do any of that and that's not cap anybody that knows me know that i really flip and go crazy if you litter in front of me i don't care what we're doing if you can throw something out the window of the car and i'm gonna stop the car and go and get it and i'm not joking everyone knows that about me um but most at least how I feel, at, okay, personally how I feel about this, my car is on E85, okay, that's no secret or anything like that, my car is on E85, it does still have cats, they're just high flow cats, but my car is on E85, so what isn't, oh my gosh, I'm sure you guys understand what I'm saying, I, this is just very frustrating, because me being a car enthusiast, living where I live, this, this, this is my escape. This is something I truly love to do. And to have someone that doesn't even necessarily understand it, who's just doing it just, just because, really, this is really how I feel, who's doing it just because, to try to take away, you know, something that we all love to do is just mind blowing to me. But this is what I need you guys to do. Don't just listen to what I'm saying. I really want you guys to watch the videos and to gain your own judgment on the fact of the matter and then decide if you want to vote for the RPM Act. I have already voted. I vote every single day um, for it. I send it in. Uh, they already created a body and everything. You can go through and read it before you send it off. But yeah, I mean, get your own opinion on what's going on with this and what you think because if the EPA manages to pass this, we won't be able to modify cars anymore for motorsports. If you buy a car from a manufacturer, you cannot modify it for motorsports. 
unless you got like a million dollars to do like a per, like a full blown professional race team instead of like amateur and like semi pro and you know you can eventually get into pro but amateur and semi pro racing which is what most of us do Cletus McFarland all of them that's pretty much what they do you get what I'm saying these aren't race cars that we spent millions of dollars on to try to make and everything these are everyday cars that we took and built with our own money our own hands our blood sweat and tears along with other people's to make a great machine and now they're trying to take that away and it really breaks my fucking heart man it really does it really does so I'm not gonna make this video long um, I just want to give my opinion on it I really don't like making videos like this but this is a very serious thing and don't think just because uh, they tried to pass this back in 2015 or something like that if I'm not mistaken 2015 2016 something like that that and because it didn't go through that time it's not gonna happen again they're trying it again it is on a federal level which means um, if it gets passed it's gonna overthrow state so that means everybody's gonna have to do it and it's just this is just really mind blowing to me man um, so please watch the videos watch that dude in blue video um, watch uh, um, I'm sorry I'm, uh, I think it's Life Apollos um, watch his videos I, I can't remember if, if that's the actual name of his YouTube channel right now but either way it's in the link down in the description he actually did a very detailed video which actually and it's not a long video either so make sure you guys go check that out man but that's all I basically got to say about this this breaks my fucking heart and I just want you guys to really gain your own opinion and vote for yourself okay I'm not trying to sway anybody I'm just giving you my opinion on the matter like I said I vote every single day um but yeah if you're not subscribed you should subscribe man make sure you get the merch I'm used to saying that but none of that is in the description make sure you go in the description and do your thing that was because I'm used to saying that that it just came off so easily but that's nah go in the description do your research and then figure out if you want to vote or not and then links to uh, how you can you know put forth and every like how you can vote and everything are also in their video so you don't even have to come back to this I don't care about this video or really I just want to voice my opinion let you guys know on my channel you know how I feel about it in case you've seen it and if it really is that serious and it really is so I just want you guys to go check that out um, and as always guys you stay classy stay positive and have a good day